<laughs> oh, thank you, thank you, and happy Halloween. Do you know our audience is full of people that look like witches and goblins? Don't think any of them are dressed up or anything. Oh, what? This? Oh no, this is not my Halloween costume. No, I'm working two jobs again. Yes, they're very busy apparently at the moment. Something to do with having to sift through 650,000 emails before next Tuesday. Anyway, for now, welcome to the Halloween special of the Hollywood Hot 100 with your PPT. Showbiz news as ever with a smattering of sarcasm. And we start today's show, you will be surprised, by getting a little bit offensive. Yes, every year there's a silly old celebrity that wears a costume for Halloween that they probably shouldn't have. And I've got one for you here. Yes, this weekend wasn't so great for Hilary Duff and a new man Jason Walsh. Why? Well, they decided to wear this. Yes, it's a pilgrim and a Native American. Well, you could imagine when that photo hit social media, there was a backlash and Hillary rushed to Twitter with an apology. She said, I'm so sorry to people I offended with my costume. It was not properly thought through. I can say that again. And I'm truly from the bottom of my heart sorry. Well, just a few years earlier, somebody else made a costume faux pas of the highest degree. Yes, it was the Dancing with the Stars judge from here in the US, Julianne Hough. She's a fan of Orange is the New Black and she thought as a tribute to her favorite character, she'd dress up like this. Crazy eyes, except she had blackface. Let's not even go there, disaster. Scott Disick from Keeping Up With The Kardashians. He's another one, what did he do? Well, in 2014, he thought it would be a great idea to go to a Halloween party dressed as an Arab sheikh. Hmm. And finally, one of my least favorite and very offensive celebrities, Chris Brown. Ugh. What did he do in 2012 at Rihanna's Halloween party? He thought it would be marvellous to turn up dressed as a terrorist wearing a turban. Mm. Well, I tell you what, you silly old celebrities, you should really have taken a leaf out of my costume book. And I've picked out three of my favourites from 2016, including Sexy Potato. Ooh, but if you don't like vegetables, what about this one? Rake Face. Great, isn't it? And finally, my particular favourite, Cold Girlfriend, a <laughs> snip at only $39.99, <laughs> presumably girl not included. Moving on, and over the years, Mariah Carey has been a Halloween feast for the eyes with her various and ooh, very tasteful costumes. Hmm. No more so than in 2008 when her and her then-husband, Nick Cannon, decided to dress up as cookies and cream before the cream turned sour and the marriage fell apart. Well, now it seems that her latest engagement to Australian billionaire James Packer is on the rocks too. Apparently he's been none too impressed with Mariah's excessive spending and there have also been disagreements about her upcoming reality show, Mariah's World as well. But Mariah this weekend was out in LA seemingly with not a care in the world, dressed in costume with her kids at O Fudge Restaurant. She was also joined by a young, handsome backing dancer, Brian Tanaka. And it seems that he's become a bit of a boner of con bone of contention in the engagement as well. But her team quick to deny any relationship there, saying she's a traditional girl who never has sex before marriage. I must admit, Mariah, you've always struck me as a shy, retiring wallflower. Oh, and she's keeping the engagement rock too, on her claw. It's worth $10 million. Well, I tell you what, being a gentleman, all of these carrots just seem a little bit too much. So I went for just the five. What's up, Doc? And finally, we close today's show with two more celebrities who got right into the Halloween spirit this weekend. I'm talking about John Legend and Chrissy Teigen. There they are, look. And they decided to share some very cute photos of their six-month-old daughter, Luna, on Instagram. And she was wearing various different costumes, which included a hot dog, a banana, as you do, <laughs> a peacock, Minnie Mouse, looks thrilled, doesn't she? And finally, Lindsay Lohan. Oh, 
I am awful, aren't I? But before I go, I'll share with you some footage of me as a baby during Halloween. Don't have nightmares, will you? Do sleep well. Happy Halloween, everybody. Bye-bye. Ta-ta. <laughs>